The Center for Biological Control at Rhodes University has for decades been using natural enemies to control water weeds in South Africa and beyond our borders. More recently, we have targeted Dhartabiaspur Dam following the resurgence of water hyacinth in 2017, when a moratorium on herbicide application was implemented. Our team, based in Gauteng and the Eastern Cape, has received government funding to ensure we can research and release biological control agents for the safe and effective control of water hyacinth on the dam. Our funding has allowed us to set up and support rearing stations in partnership with Arti stakeholders. This has ensured the constant release of control agents at key times, resulting in extensive and continuous damage to the water hyacinth infestation. The infestation was reduced from 47% to 5% cover over the summer of 2019-2020. We anticipated a resurgence of the infestation following seedling growth in spring 2020, and we were able to manage the resurgence through our continual presence at the dam and the support from the community insect rearing program. While we were concentrating so hard on managing water hyacinth, a new invasive snuck up on us, Salvinia minima, also known as common Salvinia. We are now prioritizing the testing of a potential agent for Salvinia currently in our quarantine facility. We anticipate it being ready for release this summer. Unfortunately, there is a delay in the awarding of government tenders, which is how our program is funded. To see us through until the tender is awarded, we call on the Hartis community to help us bridge the gap and prevent us closing our rearing and research facilities by donating to our Thunder campaign so we don't lose momentum. We call on you to back the dam, back the CBC and back the bugs.